roll these. When I was a kid, my mom told me that I could be whatever I wanted to be. Your mom probably did too. They're supposed to do that because they're moms. And you believed her. And so you set out to become whatever it was you wanted to be. An engineer building skyscrapers from a bin of Legos. A princess whose castle used to be a refrigerator box. A superhero with a bright red cape that gave you the ability to run, to leap, and to fly, all because you believed you could. And a light began to grow. A beautiful light. One that is inside of all of us from the day that we breathed our first breath. A light that grew a little bit more with each hug, each smile, each way to go. And then one day, someone told you that there's no such thing as superheroes, that you can't really live in a cardboard castle, that Santa Claus wasn't real, that you had diabetes. And suddenly, that inner light, once so vibrant, so bright, began to dim. The dreams and goals that once inspired us became painful reminders of our shortcomings as we told ourselves that we'd never be good enough or smart enough or fast enough or rich enough or healthy enough to achieve what we wanted. We stopped taking risks. We start to hear the can'ts and not the cans, the don'ts and not the do's, the will not, the would not, the should not, the never wills. And our lives become less and less about aspirations and inspirations and more and more about boundaries, about borders, about limits. And our light begins to slowly fade. But it doesn't have to be that way. Are you living with no limits? Are you 